Hello boys and girls, this is Aunt Fernita and I have a wonderful story for you called Noah Builds a Boat. Today's memory verse is from Jeremiah chapter 42 verse 6. It says, We will obey the voice of the Lord. The message for today's story is we worship God when we obey Him. Do you know how to make a wooden boat? A long time ago, God told Noah to build a big boat, but Noah didn't know how. Who do you think showed him what to do? God looked at the world he had made. It had been so beautiful in the beginning, but the people had become very wicked. Just a few people still loved and worshipped God. Most people did every bad thing that they could think of. God saw that what these bad people did caused so much suffering that he was sorry that he had made human beings. God decided that he would have to destroy the earth and start all over. God went to talk to his friend Noah, a good man, and one of the few who still loved and worshipped God. God told Noah, I have decided to destroy the earth because it is so wicked. I am going to send a big flood of deep water to cover all the earth, but I want to save those people who love me. Make a big boat so people and animals can go into the boat with you. God told Noah how to make the boat. I want you to use wood cut from a cypress tree. Cover the inside and the outside of the boat with pitch. That's so water can't get in. I want you to make the boat very, very long and very wide, and very tall. The boat was to be three stories tall, with a downstairs, an upstairs, and another upstairs. It was going to be a big boat. Noah listened carefully to everything God told him to do. Then he obeyed and started building the boat that we call an ark. Building such a big boat was a big job, and it would take a long, long time. Noah needed help. Noah's three sons, Shem, Ham, and Japheth, helped him. Other people helped too. They went into the forest and chopped down cypress trees. They cut the trees into long boards and made them very smooth. Then they began to fasten the boards together. Slowly and bit by bit they put the boat together. Noah followed God's instructions very carefully. The Bible says he did everything God commanded, and God was with Noah and his helpers and watched over them. God wants us to follow his instructions too. Our Bibles tell us what God wants us to do. When we obey God, we are worshiping him. That's one way we thank him for watching over us. This podcast was brought to you by gracelink.net and Studio El Piso. For more children's resources, please visit gracelink.net.